The building is situated in the Parramatta CBD. It's based on the designs of a gentleman called Le Corbusier, a Swiss Frenchman. It's known as Brutalism, the design, and it was the highest building in Parramatta at the time it was built. The building was run down. It was pretty much empty. The tenants that were in the building, many were here since 1963, and we couldn't get a return on the investment. We needed to change the way we were consuming electricity. So we had to change the air conditioning system, had to change the building management system, had to install LEDs and sensors, and pretty much try to manage how we spent the power. The building's book valuation was extraordinarily low. The rental yield was very low. The outgoings were tremendously high. For example, it cost us something in the order of fourteen dollars to $16,000 a month to put power in this building. Considering that only a third of the building was actually occupied, that would make us one of the most expensive buildings, definitely in Parramatta, maybe in Australia, for its size. The problem we had is that the consultants, the real estate agents, they all advise against um, overcapitalizing, fixing the building. They all believe that Look, this is the maximum rent you're ever going to get, make what you can out of it, but it's not worth fixing. You never get the money, you never get the type of client you're looking for, and you never get the savings you're looking for, because the technology is just too expensive. The banks won't lend on it, because the banks are not confident you get your money back. We visited a council with a proposal to build a car park at the rear of the building, and at that meeting we floated the idea of refurbishing the building. We told the council we had some difficulty in raising the finance and they proposed that we look at the building upgrade finance product. So we looked into it and we're happy we did so. We transformed an underperforming asset, so now we're three times more profitable than we were in the past. We have a better type of tenant, the building is full, it's, there's no vacancy, and more importantly, uh, people are happy to be here and want to be here. So we have a demand for, for new tenants to come in. Interestingly, the, the property owners, not just in Parramatta, have the perception that if you're going to spend a dollar, you need to get your dollar back. And old buildings are very difficult to refurbish. So we've proven you can actually refurbish old buildings, you can increase the rent, and also change the profile of the building. And of course, that follows through with the increase in the price of the actual asset. So the asset's performing better, it's worth more, and its yield is up.